So some people haven't been able to play online on World at War because they're not able to create an online profile. The reason is because Activision stopped shipping CD keys with the Steam version of World at War. There's no fucking way they're ever going to start adding them back again because it's Activision. But like the title says, it's more like a workaround, not a complete solution. But you'll still be able to play uh, multiplayer, zombies, co-op, all with your friends and shit. And I like this way better anyway. This is how I normally play. Really, the only problem is you won't be able to play on the regular World at War servers. It'll be different uh, dedicated servers, though. But it'll still be on World at War. So basically, you're just going to go to this website called plutonium.pw. You click download. Click download plutonium.exe. Save it. And then you're just going to run it right here. I also recommend going to plutonium.exe, left-clicking it, and then right-clicking it. And then clicking create shortcut. And then you just move the shortcut to your desktop. And put it wherever you want it. And then just rename it as well to like plutonium. Basically. And then you'll just be able to run it from your desktop. For me it already boots up the launcher because I already installed it. But for you it's just gonna it's just gonna start installing. Which will take like a minute or two. And then it'll ask you to uh, log in to your plutonium account. So you're just gonna go to this link right here. Forum.plutonium.pw slash register. I'll put these links in the description. And you're just gonna sign up right here. After that you put your login in. And then you click one of these two. T4 multiplayer or T4 co-op slash zombies. Whichever one you want. And then this is gonna say setup. Like it does right here. Setup. So you're gonna click setup. And then it's gonna bring up your file explorer. So you're gonna go to wherever your Steam directory is. Usually if if you have it set to the default location it's gonna be this PC. Windows. Program files x86. And it'll be Steam. But I have my Steam somewhere else, so, but you'll see Steam, Steam Apps, Common, and then you're just going to select Call of Duty World of War, and it'll say Select Folder, you'll select Folder, and then after that it should say Play, you'll click Play, and by the way, some antiviruses will stop you from starting the game up, so, if you have one, try and turn it off if it doesn't let the game start up. Initially, the resolution is probably going to be really small, so you're going to want to go to Options and Controls, Graphics, and then change the video mode to whatever your monitor is. After that, you can do co-op, you can make a private match with your friends, like Nazi Zombies, for example. But the way you join your friends is a little different. So the host is just going to set up a private server, right? And then however many friends you have, you're just going to press the tilde key, which is to the left of one on your keyboard. And then you'll type SP underscore min players space, and then however many people are in your party. So, well, for me, it's one, but you just press enter. And then it's going to, if you try to start the match, it's going to say this. So you just do X party go. And then um, you just wait for the host to finish loading. And then when the host finishes loading, it's going to say ready right there. And then they'll just tell everyone else to join their lobby. And I'll show you how to do. I'll show you how to join your friends real quick. First thing you'll have to do is go to Plutonium, click forum, and then you're going to go to your profile. And then you're just going to copy the link and send it to all your friends and then have them do the same. And then you're going to go under their profiles. There's going to be a green arrow right here that you're going to click. And then all your friends are going to add the host at least. Everyone should add the host and the host is going to add everyone back. And then you'll all be friends. You'll just go to cooperative, friends, and then once the host has the server all ready, everyone else can join him by just double clicking their name. Or if that doesn't work, you can just follow these instructions right here. And then once everyone's in the lobby, the game should just start on its own. If you want to join like a public server, you can just go to join server and it'll bring up a server list right here. You can sort, sort by players right here. Some other good things about Plutonium that I like better over the vanilla version of the game is that you can just unlock everything right off the bat by doing unlock all in the command console. And then you'll just, you'll, well, you'll unlock everything. Another thing I recommend doing is changing your field of view because plutonium unlocks it because the default fov is fucking gross as hell it's 65 you're looking at it right now the way you can change it is you open the console do forward slash cg underscore fov space then type any number between 1 and 160 i always do 100 oh see look i couldn't fucking see those zombies before could not could i basically this just looks way better you can see so much more the other one just fucking gives you a headache one more thing you can do is if you have a high refresh rate monitor you can do slash com max fps 
Shit. Fuck off. Slash C O M max FPS and then change it to whatever your refresh rate is, minus 144. And then if your PC can handle it, you'll be able to play it that ref that frame rate. It's basically all there is to it. If you need any more help, you can just join the Plutonium Discord server and ask them for help. I'll put links in the description. See ya.